Hey guys, we have a new word of the day. And our word of the day today is, um, it's a fun one to mark up. So I'm going to put it up on the board, but then I'm gonna talk you through the different parts of the word. So this is our word of the day. Now before anybody tries to figure out the word, let's talk about it. Because there are some, there's some major things going on in this word. Okay, so. And actually, I just thought of doing this, sorry, or else I would have had it already set up and ready for you guys to go. Okay, alrighty, so let's break this word up into parts. So I'm looking at the word and I see some, I see three pretty important skills that we've learned. So the first thing I see is the TH digraph. So we do have a TH digraph in this word. It's the start of the word. But the next thing I see is the INK glued sound pattern. Remember it says ink. And the last thing I see is a suffix S. So look at this word. Wow, we definitely have a fun word for us today. So here's our word. I broke it up. Ink. Okay, can you guys do that with me? I'm going to push them back up and I want you to make the sounds. Ink. Do you guys think you know what word it is? Thinks. Thinks. Very good. So here I have it on a car, on a dry erase card that I can mark up. So let's do. And notice how I'm going to, I'm starting with the, I'm starting with the base word without the suffix s. So the first thing you have to do is underline the digraph. So I'm going to underline the digraph. Then I'm going to put a box around my glued sound pattern, INK. What does INK make? Ink. Now, let's just go ahead and look at this word without the suffix S. Ink. Think. This is our base word. Think is the base word. I like to think about my choices. Think is the base word. When I add the suffix s, my word changes from think to thinks, thinks. And I'm gonna use this word as if I'm talking about somebody else. She thinks it's funny to play jokes on people. Or I could say, my mom thinks that I am really smart, okay? So when you take the suffix s off, your base word is just the word think. When you add your suffix s, your word changes to, say it with me, thinks. And that is our word of the day. The word of the day is thinks. So today for your assignment, please remember, I need you to mark up the word. You're gonna underline that digraph, put a box around the glued sound, circle the suffix s, and then underline the base word. Now, I'm going to move this over because we're going to use this word in a sentence. Okay. So, my sentence is going to be, let's do, my mom thinks that I am smart, a long sentence. My mom thinks that I am smart. Can you say it with me? My mom thinks that I am smart. Okay, uppercase letter frame. My mom thinks that, I need to do an uppercase, I am smart. 
let's do an exclamation point because that's exciting when your mom thinks that you're smart. Okay, can you read the sentence with me? My mom thinks that I am smart. All righty, I'm gonna circle my sight words that I have, my trick words. My is the first trick word. Mom thinks that. This is a trick word that we've had. I, ooh, we have a lot of trick words. Am smart. My mom thinks that I am smart. Now I'm gonna write my words, the trick word my. Uppercase, because it's the beginning of my sentence, my. Mom, mom thinks, word of the day, so ink thinks that, this is a trick word, I am Smart. This word is tricky. Oops, I'm going to do this so I can. Okay, wow, look at that sentence. My mom thinks that I am smart. Let's put our fluency sweeps in. My mom thinks that I am smart. My mom thinks that I am smart. Can you read it with me? My mom thinks that I am smart. Good job. In Seesaw, you're going to practice marking up the word thinks, and then you're going to uh, read the sentence to me and create your own sentence with our word of the day. Thanks for watching, you guys. Bye.